Hello, thank you for joining me today. Uh, today I'm going to show you how to set up a patrol or pattern for your PTZ. Uh, so first thing you want to do is open up Internet Explorer. This one right here looks just like this. Once you do that, you're going to type in the IP address for your DVR on your local network. And then you're going to type in your username and your password. We'll log in. Bring us to our live view shot. Or normally it does. I was already in here configuring, messing with stuff. Um, so after that, you're going to want to go to your PTZ. Um, but again, normally you're going to go, you'll be start up in live view. So you want to go to configure and then you want to go to camera management. And then you'll have to know which one's your PTZ. And you can find that out by going to your live view and just counting down until you see, okay, mine is on number five, I think. Let's see. So one, four, five. Okay, so I know it's number six, so I'm just going to go over here and hit it. Right here it says connect, so if I just hit on this IP address over here, it's going to open up another web page. I'm going to log directly into the PTZ. Now yours might look a little different, it might be a different type of camera, but it's going to be generally about the same kind of step. So I'm going to type in my username and password for this camera. And it's going to log me in here. I'm going to hit this little thing up here. This is my PTZ control. Yours might be in a little bit different location. And this right here is going to give me control up, down, left, right. And what I'm going to do is I want to go to this little thing over here. It says pattern. I'm going to hit this. Now, if you're setting it up, you're probably setting it up to scan a large area. So this is your speed up here. You probably want to move your speed all the way down so it's nice and slow, not fast. And then once you are ready to start recording, so if we want to say make our start position somewhere you know, over here, we want to start down here and go up. All right. So then once I get to where I want to be, I'm move my speed back down here. And then I'm going to hit this little start right here. Oh, sorry. I want to, because I already made this one, we'll go ahead and do number three, pattern three. I already did pattern two as a test. So again, let's say we're going to start over here. We're going to start. All right. Oh, sorry. Start recording. My bad. This one right here. And then once you do that, you're going to see this, and this is how much memory you have. So you can do a lot. Move my speed back down and it's recording my movements any which way I go it's going to record that so even if you want to zoom in on something so if you had a location you wanted to zoom in keep it there for a little bit it's going to record whatever you do zoom out come down whatever you want to do there and then once you get it to where you want it you're going to come over here this little disk stop recording and we're going to hit save so now that pattern should be good so if I hit play it should go and 
do exactly what I just did. All right, so if we go over to this right here, these are all my presets, my patterns and whatnot. This one here is gonna be set up under 43. So I also have 42 set up, so you can do four or five patterns. So if I do a call for 42, it's gonna start doing what that one was meant to do, whatever I made that one do. Same thing with 41. Go over here, start a scan of the whole neighborhood. And I also have 43 I can call on now. And that is how you set up a pattern. So you can do this from your phone too. Once you get it on your phone, um, you can call your presets from your phone too. You just have to remember which one it is 41, 42, 43. Or if you have a, a height vision or a different type of DVR, it may be a different DVR, but it should look about the same. Uh, all right, if you have any questions, please put them in the comments and uh, I'll address them, but I think this should get you up and going where you need to be. Thanks for watching the video.